Well, and I think it's, yes. um, you know, when I was in that place, after I left and started freelancing, I became what my husband lovingly called me the freelance godfather. People would come to me when they were in that moment of panic. And you know, just to see the look on their faces, which I've been there, is just that terror. Like, there's no other option. There is no other option. And in and, and 2008, it really felt like that. I think it's changed dramatically with the hybrid workspace and the future of work, which is awesome. But I was like, there is another option. You can build a career working 20 hours a week, working 15 hours a week here, 20 hours a week here. And just the idea of how we work being like, I have to do it full time consistently until I retire is complete BS. You know, it's like you have kids, you work part time if you want to. And then you ramp back up after they go to school, if that's what you want to do. There's there's a level of flexibility that was never discussed back then. And so being able to help people see that it was possible was really, really super awesome. And part of the reason why I also wanted to do Uncompany because I was like, people need to know that there's a third door. There's another way that they can work.